Yeah, I mean, you guys really jumped on him. What was the energy like out there early? Uh, the energy was you know, off the roof. Uh, coming out, uh, ESPN two game, uh, crowd stands packed. Uh, you can't, you can't. Um, I mean, you you don't want to play with anything else. I mean, it's one of the uh, biggest moments we had at this stadium since I've been here. So a lot of guys, we were hyped up. We were ready to play. We came out ready to play, and uh, we showed that today. Uh, at, at halftime, where did BYU make adjustments that really stopped you guys? Um, I don't really think that it was the adjustments. It was just that uh, uh, we uh, we were just taking what they were giving us. So uh, early mm -hmm. in the, I guess you would say the first half, uh, they were playing us in a lot of single single high, uh, a lot of cover eight. Uh, then in, later in the game, they start you know rolling us, so playing like you know rock coverage and stuff like that. So our quarterback, you know, he just took what uh, what they what they gave us. So no need to force the ball. So uh, and it worked out today. So considering all the load that you've been through with this program, what did, what does the win like this feel like? Uh, it's wonderful. Um, I was there at Alabama. I was there at Wisconsin. I was there at Utah. I was there, you know, for all the all those games. I was there in Nevada as a red shirt uh, on Sunday night when we lost. Um, and this is uh, this is one of the, this is the biggest moment uh, where I can say that uh, our team we rose to the occasion. We came to play. Uh, we knew that. Uh, that this was our moment, you know, to get national recognition, as Coach Mack was talking about. So um, we wanted to own the moment, and today we owned it. Now, well, how do you digest this win, knowing that Utah State pretty much has the whack wrapped up? Um, well, this is a this is a big win for our program. Uh, we beat Navy. Uh, we play Army in a couple years, um, and playing BYU, which is a, you know prestigious program. Uh, it's always a big win when you play a, a big time school like BYU. Uh, you know, congrats to Utah State. You know, for uh, for winning a game against La Tech, that puts them, I guess, in the uh, uh, first uh, for the division. Uh, but uh, make no state, uh, no question about it. Next week is still a big game for us. Uh, we want to get to double-digit wins. Um, Ten and two sounds way better than uh, nine and three. So that's what we're aiming for. We're aiming for another win. It doesn't matter what's on the line. Uh, we're going to come to play no matter what. You know, our goal is to win every game. So that's what we want to do. Well, what was the what was morale on the sideline late in the fourth quarter as the OE slowly started to creep back and. You know, how, how are the guys, how's the morale on the sideline? How, how are you guys stay close in the game? Uh, like I said, we've been in so many situations like this before. I recall Hawaii last year. So a lot of guys, you know, we were energized. We were pumping up the crowd, you know, encouraging the defense. We knew a big play was going to come. And uh, Keith Smith jumped over a guy and did a strip sack. So uh, I was happy. You know, we were all, you know, jubilant on the sideline, having a good time. So it's always good when you can see, you know, your brothers, you know, on defense, you know, hold it down for us uh, like they did in the second half. So, you know, kudos to uh, the defense side of the ball because they, they came to play today for sure. Okay, one more question for Noel and uh, keep moving blind. Great, Noel. Thank you.